चलो लेट्स डू इट ओके इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी कि व्हाट यू शुड डू बीइंग अ सेकंड ईयर स्टूडेंट एंड मूविंग टू थर्ड ईयर स्टूडेंट इन वीआईटी चैनल सो हियर वी विल सी दैट व्हाट यू शुड डू एंड व्हाट यू शुडंट एंड व्हाट यू शुड फोकस ऑन and what are the other things related to placement and all those stuff or uh, when i have to do the internship what we have to prepare or what should we do and even if you have don't have any question i have answers for you okay the question you should ask and you are not asking probably okay so i will be covering through various mistakes uh, and unawareness that i have been when i was in your shoes okay so i will uh, make sure you are aware of what uh, what is going to happen with you and uh, and what you can do for it okay so let's get started first thing first thing first uh, this is not very structured video so i will be answering random question i will just put uh, uh, you know uh, probably the time stamps to the question and all okay so let's first start the time of uh, you know whenever when your second year is going to end in just 50 days probably it's it's march 22 today and it's going to be over by may 14 or even 10 or something like that okay so so what you should be knowing is that uh you are going to be third year and uh whenever you come to campus the from the day one from the day one uh, you would be getting the companies okay so companies forward it is not placement but it's for internship okay so let me just stated as this uh there will the companies you aim for like google microsoft and all other companies where people are getting placed in vid chennai and all, all all the stuff they would this companies take uh people uh for their summer internship okay so if you are giving so you are coming in third year from the day one you are giving test of a company you get selected and stuff so you will be getting the summer internship uh for the next year okay so that is before the starting after the end of third year the summer vacation you will be getting you will be getting internship for that and this internship is consider uh, having very much weightage because it is from uh, it is first of all paid internship secondly it's from a very big company like ibm and all those stuff it's not a very small uh, company that you join to get some experience and get going get moving in this uh, get moving and get, uh, just enter the corporate world okay so And this is the thing. So that internship matters a lot. Uh, if we compare it to uh, the smaller internship, which you do by you know having uh, having contact without uh, putting a lot of effort and all those stuff. Okay. Oh, for sure, I should be careful if there would be snakes or stuff because I am coming here for first time. <laughs> okay. Uh, all right. So, um, so that is the thing. And uh, uh, and the best possible case of placement would be you get a so so internship. and in that also super dream internship which is which gets started from the day one when you will enter uh, the vit after your summer vacations or uh, in third year okay so if you get a super dream internship and you work well uh, in that uh, summer internship and that gets converted to uh, uh, full time so that is the best best possible case because you don't have to even sit in uh, placements which would which would be happening in fourth year from day one of fourth year so from day one of fourth year Uh, before that the holidays will be summer vacation and that summer vacation you will be getting that, that internship right which i told you uh, so before that placement start you are getting placed so that, uh, what would be better than that right so you have no stress you have no you know uh, okay uh, if you get like 15 lpa job you you might be stressed about getting 50 lpa jobs or something like that right uh, trying on campus off campus whatever but you have something in your hand right so that is the best possible case i would say so for getting into that state that you are capable of get uh, you know you are capable of getting that thing done so you have to uh, start preparing for whatever this companies need for uh, you know they are letting you uh, like letting you be selected for their summer internship right so yeah so what you should do okay so and what uh, what they will be asking okay so yeah uh, so what they will be asking is a lot of things but uh, what you should know uh, first of all is that round 1 round 1 is the place where they ask the dsa and uh, dsc is the most important thing to get on campus placement and uh, i would say ds is the most important thing as a software okay 
that's not a snake so as a software engineer because because what i think i will tell you okay so for on campus this first of all cdsa and uh, if you get round cl one clear then only uh, your projects of whatever amazing ml amazing dl and all those projects which you have made okay so that won't come into pre picture if you couldn't clear the round one and round one is not easy okay so uh, so from this only you can see that uh, i should focus less on development and more on dsa because now is the time now after five to six months that is july uh, July when the third year of you will start and my fourth year will start. Okay, my placement will start. Your internship season will start. Okay, so uh, on that day, uh, am I am I prepared to get that super interim internship? Okay, so may it be Microsoft, may it be J.P. Morgan, it may it may be Google, and even some company come in comes in summer only. Okay, uh, while your summer is going on. Okay, so like but that is very less, very rare. Or the majorly will start from third year only. Third year day one. Okay. Okay, so for round one, you should prepare for DSA and uh, for DSA versus development, I said you DSA only, it may be third year or it may be fourth uh, fourth year like or, or it may be long run and I am saying in long run because uh, if you are getting suppose let's say though you get the whole worst case like you got the TCS and all those stuff and if you want to uh, from TCS you want to switch to Google and all those stuff, uh, you have to give the uh, round one and the which is OS and uh, in a way dsa is the most important thing okay and in especially in fang and all those stuff they ask you hard dsa okay uh i will tell uh tell you what is hard dsa and what is easy dsa and all those stuff in some later on video but uh, i will i want to give you the awareness which you need right now today okay to grab all your opportunities and to be aware of whatever opportunities vid is giving you okay uh, i'm not saying anything extra i'm just making you aware what you should be aware of okay and which i wasn't aware uh, when I was in your shoes, that is why I I missed getting a uh, super team internship. Okay, there are a lot of other factors as well. I could make to a pre-final round of uh, IBM and all those stuff. And there are luck factors and all other factors. But yeah, uh, one of the major thing uh, was I wasn't aware. Uh, so I have made it clear that uh, okay, luck factors and all those are there. But what you should be doing is focus on DSA and be master at it so that you get to the round you get your round one clear so you can show your amazing dsa sorry development projects and all if you have made okay if you have not made still i would say focus on dsa okay because they will expect very 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 less uh, development skills uh in st uh, later stages and you just need one to two good projects for that okay so i will just uh, i will tell you in uh, later later parts of this series and stuff uh, just let me know if you are liking this just comment down uh i like it i uh, want part two and all those stuff in series uh, just let me know okay and uh, let me know your questions so that i can uh you know uh, answer those questions in my next part of the video and yeah let's just do it and presently uh i would like to say on the second portion so that is uh, from where you should do uh, this preparation, right? This DS and all. So uh, the famous uh, DSH sheet of Striver is there, and all sa sare log se kar So it be, it may be third year or fourth year even who are uh, uh, passed out, and uh, you know uh, all those people, uh, the, and those and and most of the people who are placed in MNCs and all, they have done the DSA uh sheet of striver which is a to z dsa sheet and uh this, that is the main reason and th that is what they recommend okay so that is what i recommend as well and i i want you to complete that and not complete and for th for third year i want uh you can uh, target to complete it 100 percent because in the placement you need 100 percent right but uh at minimum you should be co covering few of the topics uh array strings uh bit manipulations right uh basic c plus plus still to use hash uh not c plus plus whatever you're choosing java and python whatever thing is so you should be knowing hash map and basic data structure and i will uh say more on this uh if i get good response in this uh, otherwise i will anyway still but i would like to see your response uh in the comments of the video okay so just do let me know uh, about it so yeah that detail i will go in some other video so yeah just uh, uh so what you should do Shriver, DHC, what topics at least uh, complete array strings um, and all of the uh, basics before it. Okay. Um, and you should be targeting easy, medium question, not hard question. And first of all, do 
100 to 200 easy questions first then go to medium don't ever see hard as of now if you are getting started and for whoever have started and you know uh, they are a bit forward uh, i will say uh, uh, some about them some guidance thing later on okay so jo, just let me know your questions so that i can you know i can know that my audience uh, consists of these people and they want to know this so i can do this okay so yeah just let me know and uh, second thing uh, and after that next thing that i would like to say is that uh, okay development so how much development so development as of now like before the summer vacation i would say don't start any development uh, focus some of the development there but it should be you know one to two good projects that's it uh, and uh, that too uh, they would expect very less so uh, you should just maybe just make one good project and maybe two three projects whatever you have done in your course work and uh, and be make sure that you know uh, in and out of that so that because in your resume will put that and your interview will see that and ask question about it and judge you based on that only whatever you have made okay you will, they won't be asking you dl things if you have done only you know web development something like that so yeah um, that is one thing and there are a lot of components uh, like uh, getting the connection making use of the connection uh, getting referrals you know and um, you know uh, how to prepare uh, can i see those questions there are lead code versus code forces uh, lead code versus code chef and all those. there are tons of things and i have that question in my in my mind as well and you should have that question okay if i'm not having that question basically you are not putting uh, enough efforts towards watching not watching toward getting uh, you know uh, what you want wanted to get from this college okay uh, you came for placement right uh, or if you are not for for placement this video is obviously not for you okay so yeah so most of the thing that you should be aware about i i told you already so you should start working upon it and uh, you get more questions then you just uh, you know comment it down so that i can see that you guys need uh, parts or next part of this video and uh, so that i can make uh, other parts right so yeah just let me know and i will be making uh, other parts of the video uh that will be uh, you know making you aware what uh, you should be aware of uh, as a student in vit chennai and what your seniors should tell uh, which you maybe by chance get it or maybe you don't know the m more importance of what they were saying but yeah uh, so uh, in this video i tried to make you realize what you should do and all uh, so there are a lot of things what you should actually focus on you know there is a cgo see how much cgpa matters cgp versus dsa versus development versus uh, side hustle versus my hobby versus uh, and you know blah blah things so i can answer all those things but yeah uh, and all those other question what you have just let me know and uh, what i would say whatever you are doing you came to vit to uh, get good placement if you uh, your, uh, if you want to go for higher studies yeah for higher studies uh, let me tell you this that uh, that if you are going for higher study you have to decide it before before this sem 6 so uh, in sem 5 and there will be a uh, thing for uh, you know uh, if you want to sit for pat pat means uh, placement and all those related activity so if you want to sit for that uh, you have to pay 8000 rupees and uh, go do for its training and all those stuff so uh, you have to decide you have to, you want to go into corporate uh, sitting in placement or you want to go for higher study so you have to decide in till sem 5 and uh, I, i guess you have to decide okay and i guess you should decide it from now because otherwise there is no point of giving one year of dsa and getting the job where you wanted to go in higher study directly okay so yeah all those stuff so there you have you should start thinking about it from now uh, so i'm not answering i was saying this thing so if you so if you want to go in uh, if you go into high studies or placement you have to decide it from now because there is no point of giving you know uh, this much time to dsa and prepare for corporate where you wanted to go for uh, high studies where cgp matters a lot more than whatever it matters in placements okay so yeah um, you should do that and uh, i would say you know uh if you came for placements for uh, if you, if placement was in your mind in, uh, while coming to vit so uh, whatever th uh, things comes you know uh, side hustle business uh, or you know your whatever other things are there uh, you should you know do all those thing but you should keep in mind okay this is the best possible case if i want to go uh, into corporate and uh, get a placement and all those stuff so you should never sacrifice this thing in uh, ever Right, right. You should never sacrifice your DSA and placement preparation 
placement progression means dsa as of now presently uh, if i would say in briefly so you should never sacrifice that time to give time give a lot of time to just cgpa something like that okay cgpa matters and all uh, the all the things it matters i will say it's important later on uh, detailedly like how it matters and all those stuff uh, just comment it down if you want it uh, so that i can know what next i should be you know uh, uh, bringing up on okay so see you guys in next video just let me know and see you uh, see you next time and just subscribe to my channel and let me know what i can do more for you join my whatsapp group where i put my regular videos and uh, updates and all those stuff uh, just let me know uh, just check out the other links are there and there are there, there is this thing called uh, uh yap where i would be posting few of the guidance thing probably so yeah i will be putting this uh, yap thing link there and uh, uh, there you can follow me in my no core realm and uh, you can just explore that thing as well so yeah just uh, keep hustling keep smiling and you know just stay happy